close, my mate. Where are you hiding? You should know by now, my darling. I never lose my prey. But now, I think it's time for you to rest. No, 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 no. Don't resist. Just let it happen, my love. What is? Only dreams now. you you'd wake up safe, didn't I? How does your neck feel, dear? Still a little sore? Yeah, sorry. I didn't have my chloroform. Otherwise I would have used that. It would have taken a bit longer, but... At least it wouldn't have left the marks. But you'll be fine. All you need to do is take your medicine once every day, and they'll clear up in a jiffy. Oh yes, I've made you some medicine for it. I'm quite the alchemist, you know. Unusual for a werewolf, I know, but... Well... Boredom certainly is the best teacher. <laughs> where are you? Why, where else, silly? You're in my den, of course. <laughs> You've noticed the collar you're wearing, have you? Yeah. I couldn't risk you running off when you woke up, so I had to take precautionary measures. A collar and chain to hold you down to the tree roots. I do like these trees. Such strong, sturdy roots. Much stronger than the steel beams you humans use to make your buildings. Not even the most intense fire could burn through these. Mm hmm? Yes, my love? Hurt you? <laughs> <laughs> 
Oh, darling. You really think so little of me that I would intentionally hurt you. Well, I guess I can understand why you'd be afraid of that, given, you know, how I got you here. But I promise, my darling, that was only because I didn't have my safer way of doing it. I would never do that to you again. Unless, of course, you gave me a reason to. Such as trying to escape or hurt me. But you wouldn't do that, right? You know that I love you. And you know that I only want to care for you. Right? <laughs> Good. Because that's all I want for you, darling. For you to be happy. For you to know how much I love you. Oh, I'm so sorry. Where are my manners? You must be starving. Come here. I've got the perfect meal for you. Here you go, darling. A fresh caught deer. All quartered and perfectly cooked. Ready for your breakfast. What's the matter, darling? Don't you like it? Poison? <laughs> oh, my darling. Why would I poison such fine meat? I promise you, it's perfectly safe. Look, I'll prove it. I'll take a bite out of this leg, and then you take a bite, okay? That way you'll know that there's absolutely nothing to fear. Good boy. Okay. Here we go. It's good, isn't it? Only the finest for my mate. Hmm? How long do I intend on keeping you here? <laughs> How long do you think, darling? Forever, of course. When wolves mate, they mate for life. I'm not letting you go for anything. What about your family? What about your family? They'll be wondering where you are. <laughs> well, let them wonder. They don't need to know where you are. You don't need to see them again. Because you've got me. I'll look after you. I'll be your family. You don't need anyone else but me. You want to at least say goodbye? <sighs> well, I suppose that's reasonable. But I can't allow you out of the den just yet. I don't know if I can trust you. You can promise all you like, but I need to be certain that you know how deep my love runs for you. 
Not only that, I want to be certain that you love me too. You gave me a good chase when I asked for it. But out of fear, not love and adoration. When you can give me a chase without trying to run away, but actually wanting to be caught, just giving me a good run around so that I've earned my right to mate with you, then I'll know I can trust you. Yes, I said mate with you. What do you think being my mate meant? I'm not saying you have to do it now. And to think that you would think so little of me that I would force you into that when you've only just got to the den. I understand that you need time to adjust, my love. And I want to get you settled. And maybe... One day... You might even be lucky enough to become a werewolf yourself. Honestly, it doesn't hurt too terribly. Oh, will you stop panicking? This is all in the long term, darling. Why can't you see that? Fine. I can see you need some time alone. You have a moss bed there. If you get cold, there's some blankets nearby. I'm going out for a hunt. I'll be back soon. And darling, if I come back and see you've attempted to escape, you can say goodbye to your family. Just not a very fond one. Understood? Good boy. Love you.